Hi everybody, welcome to Tech Thursday. I'm not sure if I'm going to be doing this uh, too often, but depends on how many gadgets I do have to, to test. I mean, I'm going to say buying something every week just for the sake of this video, but I'll do my best. So today it's hard disk space. Very important, especially if you're a YouTuber and you've got lots of videos accumulating either on your laptop or your other hard disk or whatnot and uh, you're running out of space so in my case I've got uh, my laptop right next to me which is in dire need of some space, some storage space because it's full of most of the videos from YouTube then I've got uh, two other hard disks which are also full mostly because of uh, YouTube videos so I got myself a uh, two terabyte hard disk it's about almost 100 euros, it's about 95 euros, so not that expensive either. Well, it depends on what you use to, but I guess for 2 terabytes, it's not too expensive. And it's, pos it's a passport uh, type uh, hard disk, so it's pretty light, pretty convenient, pretty, pretty portable. Let's see. So what do we have here? What does it say? It's a Maxter M3 portable external hard drive. It says lasting memory and style and performance. Two terabytes USB 3 over here. Durability. Well, it supports USB 2 also. Safety key, secret zone, and auto backup. What else? You've got the warranty thing. Then you've got the quick start guide. Generally these things are plug and play so not that complicated at all. External hard drive, how to connect M3 portable, yeah, USB connection. This connection, precautions and it's on to German. Ich weiß es nicht viel Deutsch. So, you get the USB connector, Actually, not that techy but to me this is quite a weird connection, it's like two connections in one. Look at that. I don't know if it's zooming enough. Zooming out, zooming out. You can see those two. This is the hard disk. As you can see it's pretty small. Pretty light. And now I'm gonna connect this as, soon, as quickly as possible because as I said I'm really running out of storage. Connect this way. Got. Don't be looking at my both head. Connect. That's the sound. So this is the setup. And that's connected. Installing device driver software. Click for status. Your device is ready to use. So as you can see, I've got on my local drive just six. 81 megabytes of storage, free storage space, and on the new drive, it's 1.81 terabytes. Okay, so I clicked on the drive manager install, and now it's installing. So this is the program you get. We got auto backup, secret zone. I suppose that's to encrypt and password protect your um, hard disk, diagnostics, disk management, and power settings. Let's start from here. Well, this is basically to power off after a certain amount of time. Of non-usage, then... Yeah, this just tells you... Volume size, nothing special. Diagnostics. Quick diagnostic. Takes about one minute. So I'm running a diagnostic. Well, it's one of the functionality of this program. And as you can see, the driver is properly operating. 
it's fine. As I said, you have the auto backup, the secret zone, which is probably uh, functionality to encrypt and password protect your hard disk. Diagnostic we just ran. Disk management doesn't show much, and power management just lets you determine when, at how long, for how long the hard disk will stay on when it's not being used. Really, that's it. So not much use for this. Well, maybe except this. Let's see. The auto backup. Create job. Okay. Yeah, that takes some playing around with. If you have any question on how to use it, just leave a comment in the comment section down below. And there we go. I'm transferring the first files, the, the larger files I have in fact on my laptop uh, to the hard disk. 16.1 gigabytes in fact worth of data. So if you like this video, I know it's pretty basic, it just goes over at a pretty high level of what you get when you buy this uh, hard type of hard disk and maybe its uses. I've got no commission on or, or anything on, on this, it's just something just to show what I've bought. I constantly publish a video every Sunday at 5 p.m. locally, GMT plus two. I'm gonna try every time I have some tech to show or review and have a video every Thursday for Tech Thursday. It won't be limited to just tech, well, what, we, what you technically call as tech, but anything basically that I buy. Like this video, subscribe if you're new, share and See you the next time.